Hello once again, universe, everyone out there. This is Josh, and my internet code name is Spaceboot1. With you once again, making an episode of Spaceboot One's Garden, turning this um, otherwise mundane old village into something beautiful for the villagers to enjoy. Um, this is the town of Wheaton, which uh, I was just in in the last episode, so if you're with me there, um, you will have seen um, my plans for it. So the next thing I need to do to make Wheaton um, into a proper, like, productive town, because this particular town I don't just want to make look nice, I also want to make this my um, where I go for agricultural things like uh, chicken, wheat, um, and I've mentioned a few other things which I've now forgotten, but uh, they're all written down somewhere, so um, eventually I'll remember what they were. Anyways, oop, I ran out of shears. Let's go make another pair of shears quickly. I sure go, I do go through shears quite quickly. Um, uh, let's see, I, I won't use pumpkins at the moment because I want to keep my inventory fairly clear. Um, I'm probably going to run out of gravel too, um, but I guess that's just, that can't really be helped. Dirt block. Um, so yeah, the thing I'm doing now is um, gravel road, and I think I'm going to just raise this up to there. Oops, hello. Okay, and we'll drop down some gravel. And I'm going to make it connect up. Um, uh, what level should I do? Should I do it Yeah, down another level? I think I will. Now the reason I'm making this gravel road is I want to make, like, continue to um, make uh, expand on the grid that is basically already here um, but add a little you know a little building space into the village with uh, uh, nice roads around it um, and then I'll build inside and outside these new um, these nice new roads uh, let's just use some dirt to bulk up all of this uh, we'll take a flower um, yeah, we'll chop away all these. There. And this is fairly steep, but, um, that's okay. I don't mind. Uh, let's drop this gravel down. Dot, 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 dot. And we're there. Oops. Yeah, went a little too far. That's okay. Um, I just want to get rid of just one of these, actually, because um, the idea is that these roads will... Ooh, I need that. Um, there. Yeah. These roads will continue because we have lots of nice flat space, so we'll fill it out. We'll fill this... Um, very agricultural village, and we'll just take it as far as we can, as, as, and build as much as we can with it. Um, okay, so two, three, four. Did I do that right? I think I did. Um, let's just drop a gravel guideline. I don't know if I'll make this an entire road, but yeah, now we have a guideline as to where we're probably going to go. Okay, that works just fine. Um, hmm. Not sure what to do here. Uh, let me see. because this road would go right over top of that water. And the water, the pond is too small to do a bridge over, I think. 
because I'd want to do a, a wide bridge. Uh, uh, I think I think I'm just going to end up filling in um, all this. Um, filling in with dirt is what it is what will happen. Uh, so I'll pick these flowers and have them for later. I don't know if I have enough dirt to um, to do a proper fill project. Two, three, four, four. Just filling in the bottom here. Zip. You know, I just realized you probably don't really want to watch um, this road building necessarily. Um, so maybe I will go ahead and skip ahead for you. And um, more video will be in the um, making of uh, actual buildings. Okay, and here is the road that eventually ended up being built here. Um, it's funny, I thought about naming these streets, but it, if I do them very straight like this, then they probably don't need names. They'd be more likely to be numbered streets. Um, so there's that street. And then so that means that we have this huge grid to fill in with buildings of all kinds. Uh, in fact, we have another grid over here that can be filled up. And the existing grids, of course, uh, still need filling too, so lots of work to do. Um, lots of pumpkin farms to put in. Uh, what else? Lots of stuff. Uh, it's a good time to sleep now, I guess. Um, let me see. Let's Okay, so I'm going to get some um, some of this stuff, wood, and I'm going to do some more pumpkin farms. And I think this is a reasonable model. Um, yeah, yeah, I think it is. Uh, hmm, although I think I might want to do like a couple of houses in here, in this area. I could get rid of this tree, might as well. could turn this into one of those um, nice fancy houses uh, or I could not do that um, hmm okay gotta just do it just get it started Okay, so we'll need some dirt there, dirt, and we need wooden boundaries. Now, just in the interest of fun, I might make this a double. Da, 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 da. Oh, and how long are these usually? I think they're about nine long. One, two, three, four, six. Yeah, nine. So I'll make this one nine long. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Okay, so that should be good. Yeah, and there's seven growing spots in between. So it's all good. back for now. 
to. We are building pumpkin farms. There we go. I don't need this here. Well, maybe. I guess I'm not. I guess I won't do that. I'll just light it up with torches, maybe. Ba, 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 ba. Okay, looking good. Next, we gotta. Well, here, let's throw some torches on here, on the corners. Um, this is not gonna be perfectly safe but it's pretty close um, okay let's dump some water in here so we get some nice um, irrigation going good Oop, there I'll fill it up with water so yeah I think I'm gonna make this a pretty big oops uh, pumpkin farm is what it's gonna be So, I'm going to harvest some pumpkins to get some seeds. Though I probably have seeds in my chest, so I'll, I'll, go, I'll go have a look for those too. And uh, I'm harvesting melons because I can. Um, I don't think I'm going to do too many melon farms in this um, town, uh, but I think one is one melon farm is probably probably enough. Okay, I need a hoe. I need a hoe. Uh, yes, I have a hoe. Okay. Um, now, are there already pumpkin seeds here? No, there aren't any. If I turn all those, that's going to be more than enough, I think. Uh, maybe there. Okay. So, we got a farm ready to go. Oh, I guess I don't need to hoe all this, just where I'm going to plant the pumpkin plants. And I plant the plants by the water, so that when I harvest the melons themselves, um, they won't fall into the water because they'll be on these blocks. Plant there. Okay, there we go. That's another four times seven. That's another twenty-eight pumpkins. Twenty-eight pumpkin plants on the go. So that's good. Um, I think I want to do another wheat farm too. I'm gonna just do a little one. Um, I didn't realize how fast that uses up wood. Uh, what I'm gonna have to do to keep up is I'm gonna have to chop trees. And uh, so these trees are gonna have to go. Plant? I guess I'm replanting the trees. Um, yeah, I don't think I want trees here in the end, but for now, just have them growing kind of the outskirts of the village, and then eventually the village might grow to encompass the trees, but um, we'll cross that bridge when we cross it. Okay. Oh, I just thought of something. I actually do have lots of wood. <laughs> um, well, I only have two stacks of 64. Uh, so that's not an enormous amount anyways, but it's it's pretty good. So now, where do I want to put this? I want to do... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There 
there we go. And I, I feel like we need more wheat because the town's name is Wheaton. So it ought to have more wheat farms in it. Uh, okay. Oh, for some reason I'm not carrying my hoe with me even though I'm being very farmer-like today. But, um... Well, it just means that takes a few more seconds to go back and get the hoe, which is not far. Um, where did I put it? There. So I should try and keep that hoe, like, in my possession, because I will be doing lots of hoeing today. Okay, so this particular garden is going to be a wheat thing. There and there. I have lots of seeds, so we'll grab those. I'm running out of dirt, but I have plenty in the chest here, so that's fine. I haven't been using much cobblestone, although I do want to build a house eventually. Because um, like the other villages, I want this one to have lots of uh, people in it and surviving and all that good stuff. So I'm thinking of putting a house, one, two, three, four, there's not a lot of space here for a house, but I was thinking I should put one here. Maybe I'll do a, like a long skinny house, that might be fun, that opens out onto the, onto this farm. I like that idea. Um, I'm going to give it a cobblestone foundation. Um, I'm going to let it have that much space, like this little space here, uh, for grass, and a little, sp mm, maybe no space here. It'll open out onto two farms. It'll be like a real, genuine farmer's house. Okay. Um... Oh, here. I'm going to do it like this. Um, the floor inside is going to be wood. Uh, oh, we have, yeah, like planks, wooden planks. Okay, wooden planks, good. And this floor is also going to be wooden planks. Good. Um, I think I will... put a door there ultimately and that side is going to be closed off and I'm going to have a door there and oh, we need well we need a couple things we need cobblestone we also need to sleep because the sun is going down Now this farmhouse, um, I think, is going to end up having several doors on it. Um, what do we need? We need more cobblestone, probably just another stack to finish off what I wanted to do. Um, yeah, I'm not copying any existing uh, building with this one. Um, let's see. I want to make the ends very cobbly. Um, but I, I'm basically copying the general idea of um, your typical Minecraft villager houses. Um, I have lots of this stuff, so I think I will do something like that, that, that. That's kind of cool. Um, there, 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 like so. Um, uh, I 
this big space there, like a t well not that big, just a two space. Uh, how did I do that? Um, something like that. 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 How's that look? Mm, yeah, I like the way that looks. Um, we'll put a temporary torch in here. Though I think I'll want to do something else for lighting in here eventually, but that's pretty good. Um, I will do a crafting bench. Crafting table. And I'm going to do... Um, one, two... Uh, there will be a chest in here for... Uh, keeping hoes and, and seeds and things because just because now this building is going to have four doors four doors and that means that it's at least one villager will be able to live uh, because of the, because of this building, because every three doors equals a new villager uh, living in the village. Um, there. Okay, I think this is coming along quite nicely. So what I want to do next is something to do with the roof. Uh, Now it's kind of a farmhouse, farmy house, so I might want to, you know, I have all these uh, different options for uh, roof materials, um, especially since I added thatch and shingles. I think it's a thatchy type roof is what I'm feeling. I'm feeling in my gut that that's, a, that's what that is. Um, and I have lots of grass to make thatch out of. One, two... Three there. And there. Now, I like having this. Oh, let's do some glass, too, just, just to make it look like glass, um, yeah, okay, glass windows, um, yeah, you might notice I don't often do the glass panes, and that's on purpose, mainly because I just like the look of the square glass better, um, let's just do a temporary dirt filler in the middle here, da -da -da. There. Oh, I forgot to gather some cobblestone. Just gonna do glass there. Um, now let's think what we. Oh, yeah, let, well, let's grab the cobblestone first and then think. Uh, here we go. So I think I'm going to do something like that. So this is actually tall for a, oops, for a village building. Um, most, most of the time I think they'd be one less high than this. I think I like how it looks, though. 
and I was I was thinking if I should do anything uh, fancy with connecting because this is two different levels. Um, you know, there's the possibility of doing something fancy with connecting two different levels of roofs. Um, I think what I'm just going to end up doing though is just just follow the one level to its conclusion and the other level to its conclusion. Um, so they will meet here and they'll simply be different heights and it will look um, it'll look fine. I mean it'll, it'll look a little a little bit weird but I like my buildings to be a little bit just slightly off. Um, okay uh, this is gonna hurt. Ouch. Okay so zip 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 and like that see? Where's my shears? Oh, they went flying. There. Okay, shears. Let's cut that down. Okay, and let's do this side a little bit too. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. And, uh, okay. So. Oh, now, um, okay, well, I can get rid of this dirt inside, that's fine. Um, I think I should put, like, chairs in here. Um, da, 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 da. Make chairs out of, um, I'm going to do the whole, um, fence post table might as well uh, what do we need? we need a pressure plate on top there douche boosh <laughs> boosh um, let's eat some eat a snack in here Oop. ah yes nice and home like in here um, I wonder if I should do like a decoration underneath here or something, or have something hanging through, um, or if that's just fine the way it is. I think it's probably fine the way it is. Um, I like the look of this house inside. It feels big enough for, you know, a villager to live in. You know, it's one villager plus, you know, one and a bit. Um, so maybe he has friends or something, you know, it goes towards somebody else who lives in the town. Somebody else can spend like a third of their time here too. Something like that. Or this could be like a workhouse where, you know, the townspeople can, several t different townspeople can spend, um, you know, a third of their time here. So if there's four four people, they could all live here a third of their time, or, or work here a third of their time, I guess, or just be here a third of the time, whatever they happen to be doing in the, the house. Uh, there, there. I think I am going to run out of thatch. just want to make sure I define the edges. That's what I like to do first. Um, yeah, I can't turn that into thatch stairs either. Uh, so I'm going to have to harvest some more grass. How much more do I need? Not that much more. This is like 20. Plus the sides. We also need to take a real quick nap. Um, see, do I have, yes I have shears, okay, I'm going to run and harvest a whole bunch of grass, da, da, da. harvesting, 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 you know, there's, there's a double benefit of harvesting grass, and that is, one is I get all this grass, um, but second is that, uh, 
it allows for better um, planning of where to put buildings if there's not a whole bunch of grass in the way because you can see the contours of the land better and you can kind of visualize putting a building there when the grass is kind of cut away. So I like it. I like making a town with nice short grass. Um, I might, the thing is like once you put buildings in and you get everything established, sometimes it's nice to put long grass back in because it's kind of decorative and it looks pretty. Um, but that's, that's a long ways away yet. Uh, yeah, here we go. And, and that's easy enough to do, uh, with bone meal because, yeah, bone meal grows tons of grass with each click. So that's no problem. Um, let's see how much thatch that gives me. There. Okay, 20. We have enough. And we've bumped it up to 34, which is more than enough. Okay. Yeah, we'll just finish that off. And, um, oh, I'm going to need to do steps up to these two. Uh, let's grab some stone stairs out of this chest. Uh, we have stone stairs? Yes, we do. I have all kinds of different stuff. Okay, stairs stairs. Uh, very nice. It looks like it actually almost belongs here. Um, I like the way this contrasts. I'll have to... I think there are other areas of this uh, house which I don't like as much, but I'm just going to fill it in first and then see what remains. Okay. So yeah, I see that there's um, like little bits of wood poking out, but to be honest, I actually kind of like that those colors together. Um, I think that kind of actually works a little bit, so I think I'm just going to leave that. You know, I was thinking it might look bad, but um, I'm actually happy with it. I like the way this looks too. I think that looks fine. Um, we'll fill. I always like to fill in the bottom of these so it doesn't look like very. Um, do you see like that sharp corner against corner? I don't really like that, so I like to just fill it in. There we go. I think that looks nice. I like how you can see into the window too, and it looks like there's like rafters in there. Um, they're not perfect rafters because there's you can't actually walk on top of them, but I think it kind of has that effect on it anyways. Um, so yeah, so I'm happy for that. Um, oh, it's funny. I, I guess um, I'm going to use up almost exactly all of the thatch I made. I'm going to use up all the thatch stairs that I made. I'm not going to use any of these um, square, like uh, cube thatch cubes for the... Sometimes you use those on the middle or on corners or stuff like that, but this house doesn't have any corners. Um, like doesn't turn any corners it's just one square okay so let's go in here yeah this is nice super cozy um, maybe I'll do a furnace in here mm. well that probably didn't need to do a furnace because that's sort of what um, blacksmiths are for and this town doesn't have a blacksmith um, I'm thinking about that. Maybe I should add a blacksmith later sometime, but um, but no. Um, well, <laughs> that's one. I, well, a couple of projects. You know, it's an it's a quite an improvement on the town of Wheaton. Um, uh, yeah, I think that looks good to me. I mean, it looks a little bit weird in there, but um, no, I, I like it. I like actually how that looks. It looks very cozy. Um, yeah, we've improved this town quite a bit, so um, with that I'm going to end this particular episode, and I think in the next episode, um, well, you never know, because plans change, but I think I will continue to work on the town of Wheaton and add different things. Um, I am going to want to do a fishing hole, so that's off in that direction maybe, a uh, fishing hole. Um, 
and what was the other thing? Oh, the chicken farm. I have to improve this chicken farm over here. Or possibly just make a second chicken farm across the way from it because um, yeah, there's two lonely chickens. It's kind of a pathetic old chicken farm, really. So, um, yeah, so lots to do yet on Wheaton and lots to play in the game of Minecraft for me in Space Boot One's garden. Um, you know, it's a huge world. we got lots to change, so uh, stay tuned, and, and uh, <laughs> bye for now.